Hi, I'm LaShawn and welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time here and you want to be inspired on a daily basis, then this is the perfect place for you. Start now by subscribing and clicking the bell. Hello, it's me LaShawn and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm so glad you decided to join me here today. We're going to have a good day today. We are going to head off to, 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 to guess what? Uh, Iron infusion therapy. I know. It's one of them days. It's going to be a long day. Iron infusion therapy takes all day. So that's where I'm headed. I'm already ready for the day. Now, whenever, I'm not sure if any of you have to do iron infusion therapy, but iron infusion therapy is for me personally, is I have to get iron, I have to get magnesium, I have to get potassium and a B12 shot. Uh, sometimes I need a blood transfusion, so I'm not sure my blood work is in. It, right now, he's just saying that I have to do my iron infusion, so that is what I'm doing today. I don't know if it'll also be blood. If it usually is blood, then I usually have to stay at the hospital. So I'm praying to God that it's just iron infusion today. We'll get in there and we'll see. And uh, it's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a great day. You know why? Cause I remember this time when I went and got my treatment last month, I didn't have no headphones, okay? Because I usually keep one in my, I got what I call an overnight bag. And I start taking that when I start getting sick because sometimes I go to an appointment and I wouldn't come back home. And my daughter come and pick me up, take me to Gainesville, get my iron infusion, and they keep me there. So I have to be proactive. So I, I call myself having a, a bag. Now, in that bag, I've got Sudoku, two pens, because one always run out of ink, okay? I have a copy of my vaccination for COVID. I have uh, uh, my VA card my, and my insurance card. I have my driver's license, and I have a debit card, okay? That's all you need. But when you have an overnight bag, just in case you got to go to the hospital, you also have to put in whatever you need. And I put in um, a urinary pads because I use them. I also put in a, um, a, a, a pen for my diabetes. And then if I don't use it, I have to throw it out, obviously, because of the the factor but I usually uh, keep it and then if I know that I'm staying I let the nurse know that I have it so it can be refrigerated uh, also what else is in there oh my headphones uh, what happened last time was I always keep the headphones in there because I don't use them at home and my daughter bought me new headphones uh, the high tech you know you keep in your ear no um, cord or anything i still don't know how to use them okay uh but anyway she bought them for me so i took the old ones out of my bag but i never put the new ones back in uh that was a rookie move okay won't happen again because i have headphones in there so i got my Sudoku book my headphones my proof of vaccination and that is what you need to take in this world when you have a doctor's appointment that could turn into a Overnight, you have to have, if you're diabetic, diabetic, if you, um, and then I have to, I don't have on my necklace now because I'm going for infusion, and infusions is my port that's, uh, I got surgically inserted, which does all my treatment, so I don't have my, um, my medic alert on, I'll switch to the bracelet, that's in my bag, uh, that type of thing, so, um, my glasses my glasses case and uh, that's it that's all i have in my bag so uh, for days like this that i know it's going to be a all-day infusion i also pack a lunch because it when i used to do my um iron infusions in gainesville it was a whole different story they had a system set up that if you were there for iron infusion or and or for cancer treatment, then you would have, they have lunches and juices and water in the fridge. They have a cappuccino machine, okay. It was, I have to take nothing up there. But here, I, I have to go to local place, a cancer specialist for my treatments and for my iron infusions. And they have snacks like um, cookies and 
people donate so it's different every day i couldn't tell you exactly they have crackers and stuff like that but like i said it's an all-day affair and you diabetic you don't need to be up in there passing out okay because the nearest hospital is uh the the what it ain't chance no more what is it called u of f i have no problem with that hospital but it's not my regular and i'm not tr i'm not trying to pass out okay for lack of food so you i'm getting to. ready so i have to pack a lunch so i'll eat breakfast like oatmeal or bagel or something like that i have to make sure go do all my blood work do all my um infusions today and then in a couple of hours i'll be hungry and they'll have snacks but that is not gonna to you know gonna take me until half the day so i have to take a sandwich or something which i will so i'll take a sandwich i'll just drink water and then if i want a snack i'll get you know they got crackers they got peanut butter crackers that type of thing and that is how my day is gonna go so i am ready to uh face this day with a positive attitude knowing that god has got me covered and that i ain't finna stay in the hospital okay ain't nobody got time for that because it steps backwards we moving forward okay that's why me and that's how me and my doctor talk i tell my doctor look i got things to do okay i ain't got time to be in the hospital so anyway enough of that have a good day everybody i'm finna head out i'm finna get my food pack my lunch and get ready to head to this appointment so i'll see you when i get back <laughs> hello good morning youtube this is LaShawn, and it's cold this morning. I'm out here, and it's cold this morning. And we out here waiting on our ride. Oh, I might have to go back inside. Ugh. See that van right there? That is my ride. Ooh. There go my ride. There it is. Okay, so here we are. We are on the Jacksonville Transit Authority van and this van gets me to where I have to go. It's much, much cheaper than Uber or Lyft and I pay a flat rate each way. So we're almost there. And today I'm going to cancer specialist for my iron infusion appointment. And again, this takes um, uh, most of the day. Okay, so this is where all the infusions and treatments take place. You find a, a nice spot, and um, I'm all situated. I'm waiting on my nurse now to um, hang another bag, and um, I'll have limited uh, video back here because of respect for people and their privacy, and... Um, I got everything I need. As you can see, you see this hat on my head? I have my glasses. I have my Sudoku. I have my headphones. I have my phone. And now I'm about to do the Sudoku while I wait for her to hang on this bag. And the bag is hung. I'm all hooked up. She just gave me a nice warm blanket. So, look at me. Peace. Maybe a nap. As you can see, everything is hooked up. See? That's where my port is. I'm showing you. So you can see that's where all my uh, stuff goes in. And I'm going to just rest here. And this takes about... Um, it's just me back here. So that's the blessing. Me and one other person. And I'm going to respect his privacy, but I just wanted to show you that um, 
it's plenty of seats on this side. It's beds back here, and it's a whole nother side. I like this side here because it faces a window, and um, and that's enough of taping for now. I'm going to take a nap, and I'll get back with you when I wake up, but this is a perfect time for me to take a nap, a new bag, so I'm going to rest. So one of the nurses was nice enough to order me food. So I have a delivery from Cracker Barrel. Very, very kind of her and I'm very, very hungry, so I'll eat it. Okay, so now all of my infusion is over. This is a combination of six hours later. Like I said, I just taped the bare minimum for people privacy. I wanted to show you this hat to show you that um, very nice people have uh, made these hats for us here for all the cancer patients and all of the infusion patients. So I got me a nice warm hat for when I have to come out here. And uh, that is a blessing. So now is the waiting game. I have to wait for my ride. So I'll do Sudoku. This is a simple reminder. Every time that I come here to cancel specialists, I always see people that's worse off than me. So I just wanted to do a disclaimer and say that I am thankful to God for another day. I'm thankful to God that I'm able to do this Sudoku puzzle, that my, my arms, my legs, and everything work. And I just want you to take a minute today to thank God for whatever it is that he has blessed you with. He has blessed me with the sight to see these words on this page. And he has blessed me for another day. I am truly grateful. And I hope that each and one of you are as well. Okay, so that's the end of that. Okay, enough of that. It's all, it's a wrap. The appointment is over. I didn't have to stay in the hospital. So that's a blessing in itself. So I thank you for joining me here on this journey today. And if you're new here, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I just got a little YouTube channel here, but we loving God over here. We're frugal, clipping coupons, okay, and saving money at the grocery store. So come and join us and click that button and be notified every time that I put out a video. Okay, so now we're going to breathe in and breathe out and get this day started. You ready? Let's do it. Thank you, Father. We thank you for this day, Father God. And wherever you got to go today, wherever you headed, be kind to people. All right? Be kind and be respectful. And remember that God loves you, and so do I. Have a blessed day, everybody. Bye-bye. Thank you guys for watching today. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Take a minute to leave a comment. I look forward to talking to you soon.